What's going on everybody? It's been a while since I brought you into my kitchen but I thought I'd start with a few videos of some bodybuilding recipes. Everyone seems to think that cooking good food has to be boring, plain, chicken, rice, broccoli. I'm here to change that stereotype. So sit back, watch and enjoy. On the menu today we have chicken stuffed with mushroom, spinach and feta cheese. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. You're going to need a few ingredients, you're going to need some chicken breasts, you're going to need some spinach, some mushrooms, some onions, some feta cheese and some organic rapeseed oil. Alright, so first of all find your favourite chipmunk dish at Bugsy and put it on. Put some rapeseed oil in the pan, add the onions and the mushrooms and fry lightly with a little bit of Himalayan rock salt. Preheat your oven to 200 degrees and butterfly your chicken breast. So cut it down the middle, don't cut it all the way through. Just cut it open so you can unfold it to put the contents in the middle. As you see here. Cut off some feta cheese, cut it into little cubes, crumble it however you want to do it. I didn't want to get my hands messy because I had to operate the camera. So I decided to cut it. I put a little bit of Cajun seasoning on the top of the chicken breast just to add a bit more flavour. This is completely optional, it's up to you. If you're watching your sodium then I'd probably leave it out but if you're drinking a lot of water like me then have it. Add the spinach into the middle of the chicken breast with the feta cheese. And then add the onions which you have just fried with the mushrooms in the middle of the chicken breast as well and then fold over to create the stuffed look. Get some fry light sunflower one calorie spray, put it on your griddle pan. Be very plentiful with it, it's only one calorie per spray. And then seal the chicken breast. So sealing just means that you're just going to grill it for maybe about 30 seconds to one minute each side just to hold the flavors in. Once you've completed this task, put it in a piece of foil. Make sure that you don't wrap it tightly. That's not the aim of this. We want, it, we want the air to get around there. We want it to cook and keep it suckling and moist. So just create a little pocket and then seal the top a little bit but don't make it tight, let it have some air around it. Do this for all of the chicken breasts and then put it into the preheated oven which should be nice and toasty hot right now. Put it on the timer for 25 minutes. After 25 minutes, take it out of the oven and it should be ready. Now it's time to plate up. Now, I didn't make a side to go with this. I'm probably gonna have some sweet potato and some green beans, but let me show you the final product because it looks so tasty. Look at the juices. Do you see the juices in the foil? Oh, mm, 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 mm. Cut it, go and cut it, cut it. Open it up. Oh yeah, baby, yeah. It looks so scrumptious, it looks so tasty. So sweet and succulent. This doesn't look like a bodybuilder meal, but it really is. Mm. Alright guys, so there you have it. The chicken breast stuffed with feta cheese, spinach and mushroom. A bit of onions. I'm gonna put the macros on the screen so you guys can see exactly what we're getting. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give me a thumbs up. Let's me know that you like these videos and I will continue to do more. Leave your comments in the comments section. Let me know what you think. Share with your friends across Facebook, Twitter, any social media platforms. It would help me out a lot. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And remember, eating well doesn't have to be boring. Catch you next time. Peace. Remember to always be true, no matter what you do. I run it, I never front it. I got my own.